crazy. Uh huh. It's your voltage. Yep. The only thing that I that I'm afraid of, George, with the whole whole going to the smaller drones, is if you get stuck in a tree, you're pretty much stuck. With the bigger five-inch drones, you can actually use the weight to get out of the tree. But I'm kind of curious to see how well these are going to handle in trees and scraggle. Uh huh. Well, we can test that later, but not on this one. <laughs> no, I don't want to do that. What do you think so far? It's nice. Do you notice the lighter weight? Oh yeah, yeah, you can definitely notice the lighter weight. It's like really responsive. Yeah, you can push it. I've got it really secured in there now. Wow. Just keep an eye on your voltage because I don't know the, the time on that battery. Let the battery come back up for a second. We're at 22.6 now. It's only 450 milliamp battery, too. <laughs> I'm just going over here by the tree. That is exactly what I felt, too. It's like totally weightless. Nice. How much minutes did you get out of it? Like four. <laughs> yeah, about four or five. <laughs> well, that's typically what you get out of a, a much bigger uh, setup. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, usually about four, four and a half minutes for a five inch rig. All weighing a fraction of the weight. I'll let you hold it. It flies like a five inch though. I mean, I was very surprised. Quick, agile. Mm hmm. Yep. Oh, you. We have measured speed on it, but uh. Oh, we can do. Do you have another battery? Yeah. Motors yeah. are cool. Let's see. Oh yeah, you're good to go. There's like nothing. Uh huh. All I'm right. just kind of curious to see. Like, I mean, I don't want to test it out here, obviously, but I, I'm kind of curious to see if the lower weight will actually allow you to get out of these trees like this, or if it, the tree will actually hold it. Um, yeah. It, yeah. It's I don't pretty, know. I guess we'll have to find out one day and see. Uh -huh. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it today, but.